What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. And on today's video, we're going to be talking about why we need more black billionaires and millionaires. <laughs> Specifically, we're going to be talking about five things I learned from my guy, Dan Henry. And he's definitely someone that I'm looking forward to having on a podcast. So I'm just going to put that out there. Dan, podcast, you, me, let's go. Let's get it. <laughs> so look, if you guys want to learn the five things I learned from Dan Henry, definitely make sure that you stay to the full end of this video. And let's tap in. All right, guys, today's video is sponsored by my manifestation deck. This deck will help you keep your mindset straight, also motivate and inspire you every single day to stay on the vibration that you need to stay on to accomplish the things that you need to accomplish. I'm gonna pull a card and let you know what today's vibration is. It is the world is yours. So that's 100% true. Make sure that you stay focused and stay locked in on what you wanna accomplish, all right? Now let's get to the video. All right, so I'm gonna give you the five things I learned from Dan Henry, and I'm just gonna break it down. Now Dan's somebody that I've been following for a while. He's definitely somebody that's very inspirational, selling high ticket, or just teaching sales in general. And if you haven't locked in with him, let me just teach you the five things I got from him. I got a lot, but I'm just gonna share five things. And then you can do your own research and tap into them yourself. So number one, know what you're actually good at, focus on that, and then delegate what you're not good at. Find someone else or find some more people that are actually great at the things that you are not good at. And that's exactly how you can actually not only get better in your business, but you can grow that thing a little bit faster. So like for me, I know I'm not the best when it comes to like organization and being effective. So I'm gonna bring somebody else on that's gonna be a master in that so then that frees me up from thinking about it and I can focus on the things that I'm actually good at. So what is something that you're good at? Find somebody that's great at the things that you're not good at and that's going to help you grow. So that's number one. Number two, high ticket sales will grow your income fast. So I asked a client the other day, how much money that she wants to make? She told me $3,000, but her average product is around 60 bucks. That's her average sale. So that means she needs to sell 50 of those things, 50 times 60 to get to 300, right? Let me, let me double check my math. Yes, I was right. She needs to sell 50 of these things at $60 to make $3,000. But what if she had a $1,000 product? She only needs to sell three of them. What if she had a $1,500 product? She only needs to sell two of them. What if she had a $3,000 product? She only needs to sell one. So high ticket will allow you to duplicate your revenue faster and get to your monthly goals faster with less effort. So that's the number two thing I got from Dan Henry. Number three, the third thing I got from Dan Henry is that sell the identity, not your product or your service. So if you teach people how they can become the person that you want them to become, they will by default buy your products and services because they're going to need it. So if you sell the identity of the person that your client or your customer needs to become, they will buy your products and service by default because they need them to operate on that particular level. So sell the identity, not the product and not your service. A lot of people out here are saying, buy my stuff, you need this, you need this but they're not giving value and they're not teaching people the type of person that they need to become so they can actually use these things. They're just pushing the sale. So if you help your client become the person that they need to be, watch your sales increase. So that's the third thing that I got from Dan Henry. So the fourth thing I got from Dan Henry actually goes with the third thing, right? So the fourth thing is your clients and consumers, they wanna buy certainty. So as you're selling the identity, you don't wanna sell them products and services, right? You wanna educate them, inform them, bring them solutions. And the more solutions you bring them, the more information you bring them, the more education you offer them, they're gonna feel more and more certain so it's going to be easier for you to actually make transactions happen because clients want certainty. They don't want to be convinced. And by helping them become the person that you want them to become and they're more certain about it, they're going to spend more and more money with you and you're going to get more and more clients. That actually blew my mind. So that's the fourth thing I got from Dan Henry is people want to buy certainty. Now the fifth thing I got from Dan Henry is this one's actually really, really dope, right? And I actually believe in this a lot. So if your friends, family, people that you hang around with are not necessarily where you want to be, right? They're not leveling up. They're not striving to become the best version of them. You need to join a mastermind, a coaching program, a mentorship, a networking group, something. You need to put yourself in a position to be around with other people that are going to challenge you and level you up and that are striving to get to the next level. People that may even scare you because of the level of success that they're hitting, but you just want to be around that environment because you just want some of that to rub off on you. So your friends and family may not be striving to become the best version
version of themselves. So if you hang around them, that's what you're gonna get. So you may need to put yourself in an environment that has other people that are becoming, that has other people striving to get to the goals, that have other people that are looking to be uncomfortable. And that might mean you may need to spend some money. So join a mastermind, a coaching program, a mentorship, a high level networking group, something that's gonna position you to go to that next level. And that's the fifth thing that I learned from Dan Henry. So if you guys got value from the video, definitely leave a comment below, share, subscribe, get this video out to more people. And it's because of you guys that I continue to make these videos and share people that, that inspire me and motivate me. So these are the five things I learned from Dan Henry and I will see you guys on the next video. And podcasters, how would you like to make five or six figures with your podcast? Did you know that most podcasters do not make any revenue? It's because they think they need brand deals, sponsorships, and a large audience to monetize your show. But what if I told you, you don't need none of that. Just a simple four-step framework to position your show to be monetized. And I can give you the game completely for free. All you need to do is head over to podcast2profits.live and I'll see you in this exclusive training. I'm going to give you all the game. What are you waiting for? Head over to the train. Let's go.